it's Sam. So it is that time of year again, the time where we start to get ready for Christmas. And today I'm gonna to be partnering up with Walmart to share some really unique gifts that you can get under $25. I am gonna share a couple of ones that are over, like, you know, kind of more expensive ones just because I think that those are great items that we have and um, I know that anybody would be happy to get them, but everything else is under $25 and they're quite unique. So let's go ahead and jump right on into it. If you guys are looking for Christmas gifts, Walmart has seriously so much variety of stuff. They have everything that you could ever need and their shipping is so fast, you guys. I order it two days later, bam, it's here. It's super good. So I highly recommend checking Walmart. Their prices are awesome and they have everything that you could possibly need for anyone on your list. So everything will be linked down below if you guys wanna check anything out that I showed here today. I'm also gonna link a few other items that I would recommend picking up that I didn't pick up, but just some other items that you might wanna check out that's on walmart.com. I think the first category that I'm gonna start off with is like the gardener, someone who likes plants, just kind of like the plant mama. So the very first things I got, and I've actually just been putting them on my plate because um, I just got them in yesterday and I have not got little pots yet, but this is such a great idea. And you get a set of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. You get 20 little succulents. Oh, I just blew a bunch of dirt everywhere. You get 20 little succulents and they come in these little pots. Um, they do leak obviously because <clears throat> they have a uh, little hole. So you, you're probably gonna wanna get like an actual pot or maybe you want to make like a little arrangement or something like that for someone but these are really cute and then you get all of these different varieties of uh succulents like this one is so cute so we've got this little guy this little guy oh they're falling out so there's a bunch of different varieties of um succulents and i thought that that was a really good gift so my neighbor last year got me she gave all of us like in our little neighborhood friendship group, um, a plant. And it was just like a little plant. Mine died. I killed it. But I just thought it was such a, a cute and unique and like really thoughtful little gift. And it's something that can last you all year long. And you, well, unless you kill it like I do. And you keep it alive. And it's just like your little baby plant friend. So I think this year I wanted to give like little plants to the teachers and to friends. I just think it's a really cute idea. It's super affordable. It's not going to break the bank. So I believe that this one was around $40. But I figure you're not going to give the whole entire bundle. So it's kind of like, you know, to me it's still under $25 because you're breaking it up and you can give like lots of different people one little plant or two plants or make a little arrangement. So it still falls into the under 25 for me just because you're not gonna give everyone, you're not gonna give one person 25 plants. So that's the first item. So the second item I actually need to put together, which is typical, basically there are these little um, like garden hooks that you know, it comes with the pole. So I think that goes into this like this, am I right? I think I am. I don't know how it attaches though. Maybe there's a nail that goes in there or something, but basically it attaches like this and then you've got your little hook that it sits on. So this is gonna go, oh no, nothing attaches there. Okay, here, oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna do it. I think I can do it super quickly. God, I'm so handy. So handy. Okay, that goes like that. This goes, oh, it's not squeezing on properly. Hold on, get in there. Okay, no, no, well, I'm not strong enough. But anyway, there are these little stakes that you pop into the ground, oof, like this, and you can put them by your front, oof, front door and then they're like little solar powered lanterns and there's two of them. So they come and I thought this would be really cute to have on either side of the door, um, just for, I mean, you can have it all year, but especially for the holidays, it's nice to have a little bit of light when it starts to get dark super early. And these ones were do 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 for $16.99, super affordable. Again, great for the gardener, great for someone who likes to spend a lot of time in their garden and outside and like kind of decorating that kind of stuff. So these are perfect and they're under $20, which is so great. Okay, another great item for, oh gosh, have I messed this all up? No, I haven't. For the gardener, for the person who likes to spend a lot of time outside, um, these are so cute, you guys. So these are little solar pal, I can never say this right, solar pan, solar powered, that's the word, hummingbirds, and it's a little, um, what are these things called? 
Let me look it up. I can't remember what they're called. I'm like having the worst brain farts lately. Solar changing wind chime light, $13.49. So again, this one's under $15, super affordable. My dog's just knocked over my lantern. Um, but they're just cute little hummingbirds and then they light up at nighttime. I love hummingbirds. I think that they are peaceful creatures. I think they're lovely. I miss my hummingbirds back in North Carolina. I had a bunch of them that used to come and I fed them every day and I miss them so much. So I thought that this would be a really great gift if someone loves hummingbirds as well. I know a lot of people say that if a hummingbird comes to you, it's like a loved one that has passed. There's a lot of different things about hummingbirds, but I absolutely love this. And I think for under $15, it's such a great gift. And I think anybody would love it. I mean, unless they hate hummingbirds, then that would be a situation. Okay, and then this is such a cute idea and this is super affordable. So these were $19.55, so under $20. This is a package of 80,000 wildflower seeds. Hummingbird and butterfly wildflower seeds collection. There's 23 different varieties. Um, including milkweed, nars nasturtium, and forget-me-nots. Look how pretty the packaging is. I just think it's so cute. There's Maltese cross, lemon mint, four o'clock marvel, poppy, sage, catchfly, marigold, zinnia, tree mallow, alisum, alisum, how do you say that? Foxglove, larkspur, cosmos, snapdragons, like all of these gorgeous wildflowers. And I think that this is such a lovely gift. You can either give this as a whole or you can break it up into like tiny little sachets or baggies or something cute like that um, and give lots of different people like a plant and then some seeds or something like that. So I thought that would be really cute for the gardener. And I actually used to have a ton of wildflowers in my garden when I was a little girl. Um, my mom used to like love gardening. And I remember like she had some of these specific flowers in there. So I just thought this would be such a lovely gift and it's very lightweight if you would need to send it to someone. So that is a really great option for someone who just likes to, who likes flowers or who likes to spend time in their garden. And then another thing that I thought could be either for a gardener or for someone who does arts and crafts or does a lot of cooking is this really adorable um, apron. And this is from Drew Barrymore Flower Home. And I love her prints. She's very, very 70s, very boho, kind of eclectic. There's a lot of color and prints in them. And this one um, is called the Apro Apron Tablier. No, I have no idea how I say that. How you say that? Uh, but anyway, it's really gorgeous colors. This again would be super cute to gift with the um, the seeds because when you're gardening, you do get dirty. So you know you might want to wear an apron when you're doing it. Um, cause then you can keep all of your little, you know, bits and bobs in the pockets, but this one's really good because it does have these massive pockets in the front. Um, and then it's got really pretty like birds. Is it birds or is it trees? I think it's a peacock. Yes. Or maybe it's a quail. I don't know. Some kind, some kind of bird on there and there's flowers and tropical trees. It's just super beautiful. And I love the pops of mustard and the mauve and the pink. It's really, really pretty. So I thought that was really fun. And this again would be great to gift alongside like the seeds or the plants or whatever, $12, super affordable. Also the sun is coming in here all strangely. I'm so sorry about that. Every time I wanna film, it just seems the sun just wants to go in the most awkward spots. And because I have a huge box of stuff, I didn't wanna have to tote it through the house because quite frankly, there's stuff everywhere and I'm gonna trip over. So I've left it in here. Um, so that's where we're filming today. Now we're gonna move on to the active, kind of outdoorsy type person who spends a lot of time outside or spends a lot of time exercising, that kind of that kind of person. So this is really great. This is by Ozark Trail and it's just a fanny pack. You guys, I love fanny packs. I'm so glad fanny packs came back because they are so handy. When we go on hikes, I always have a fanny pack. I can keep my phone in there. I can keep my keys, some chapstick, sanitizer, whatever. And then you don't have to carry a big old thing. Or if you're going on a really long hike, then I'll bring a backpack. But I always have a fanny pack as well because it's so easy to just stick your phone in there when you wanna like snap a picture of the kids or whatever. So this is great. Um, I actually got this for Jay for Christmas because he has a really big fanny pack and I, I noticed he never brings it because it's so big. So I wanted to get him like a medium sized one just so he could stick his phone in there and whatever. Um, so this one has a little front pocket with a spot for your cards and stuff, which I think is quite handy. And then it also, and it's kind of like a nice like foresty green color, or, you know, khaki green. Um, you've got a zip pocket here and then you've got quite a big section um, in the main section. And then you also have 
a zipper on the back. So it's got a lot of different compartments. And let me look up how much this was. Where did I just put my phone? $14.95, again, under $15. Super affordable, great little gift for someone who likes to spend a lot of time outdoors or maybe just a busy parent who like doesn't want to have to, you know, pack a bag. It's just super convenient. You can fit snacks in these things. There's all sorts of stuff you could stick in these. So I think for under $15, that's amazing. Okay, another great idea for the outdoorsy person, maybe someone who goes on a lot of, um, whoops, a lot of picnics, anyone who just wants to spend outside at the park or maybe, you know, just a mom who spends a lot of time at the park, maybe soccer or sports or whatever. I just figured this would be such a great gift um, because it's a little like picnic blanket. This is by Ozark Trail as well. It's called, oh, it just says Ozark Trail Outdoor Equipment. Did you guys hear that? Okay, I can't even talk today. Um, this is the waterproof picnic blanket. Pack and tote with ease. Folds compactly for convenience in carrying oversized to fit the whole family, padded soft fleece with eco-friendly backing so that you stay dry, and can be used for a multitude of activities, picnics, concerts, or tailgates. Oh, see, yeah, concerts, I didn't think about that. So this is great because you have one side that you can stick down so that if the ground is a bit moist, you're gonna be okay, you will not get a wet bum. Um, and then it's nice and fleecy and cozy, and it looks very festive and Christmassy. So this was 24, I believe 24.95? 24.95, so just under $25. And I think that's a perfect gift for anyone who spends time sitting outside and doesn't want to get a wet bum. Next, we have a soccer ball. I feel like you can never go wrong with soccer balls for kids. This one is by Umbro. Um, Phoenix actually requested a soccer ball for Christmas. We have a ton, but I don't know. They don't, I think they're packed at the moment, so I just I don't know where they are. Unpacking is not going well. Um, so, and this one's nice, and I believe it was like fifteen dollars, if I'm correct. Let me just have a look. Let's let's just see here. I'm sorry, twelve dollars, twelve dollars and eighty-eight cents. Kids just love kicking around a ball in the backyard. I can join in, kick a little ball, and um, it just keeps them busy, keeps them active and it's super cheap. Okay, next item is a yoga mat. So they actually had a lot of different colors. I got a bright pink one. Um, I absolutely love yoga mats, not only for doing yoga, and I actually need to get back into it, but I just can't seem to find the time anymore. I'm so busy with just at home learning and then working and trying to unpack this house, which never seems to be happening, that I have totally fallen off my yoga situation. I keep on saying I'm going to get back into it and then I just never seem to find the time. So um, yes, at the moment I'm not doing yoga, but I would love to get back into it. And I just feel like yoga mats are awesome, not only for yogis, but a lot of the kids are at home learning right now. And like my kids, they do PE at home. So if your kids are doing their PE at home, you know, they're doing workouts on the floor. So it's really great to have a little yoga mat for them so that they're not slipping all over the place, that they have like a comfy spot to sit and like do whatever workouts they're doing on, you know, on the computer with their PE teacher. So I thought this would be great for kids, but also, you know, for people who like to do yoga as well. It's just a yoga mat and then it has a cute little carrying case as well. Next, we're going to move on to just things that you can have around the home. So this I thought was really cute and it is a little lantern and it kind of is just a nice little you know super cute piece you can put it in your entryway you can put it in an office you can put it anywhere and you can put like little flameless or um yeah flameless right that's what they're called flameless candles in it then it creates like a little glow so it's kind of festive and cozy you put it around you know on the fireplace or somewhere in the living room where you all gather um and it was super affordable they had two different sizes i believe this one was the small one let me just check i think it was the small one there was a bigger one that was like 24 this one was only 14.94 but i thought that, that was a really cute gift idea to give to someone because everyone likes a little bit of a glowy flicker don't they a little glow we light so that's really fun and then this is a great gift if you just don't know what to get someone or maybe it's someone at work in the office maybe it's a family member you're like I don't know what to get you you're impossible this is super nice this is the Enviroscape relaxing fountain and I feel like the sound of like water running is just so soothing and calming and like peaceful I just thought it would be a great like present for a colleague because they could have it in their office and then it's just like that nice peaceful water sound and it just it's nice it's just good if you don't know what to get someone this one was $24.99 so just under $25 and it looks like this so just very nice and simple and then they've got a little water fountain at their 
office or just having in your house or maybe in your entrance. It's just kind of cute and it's great for someone you just don't know what to get. Okay, and then another item that is like kind of one of those things where it's like it's for the home, you're not sure what to get someone. These are great. Himalayan salt lamps are awesome. They actually are supposed to be good for your health as well. There's like a lot of benefits to them. Um, but basically, this one's actually like so heavy. My gosh, it's like ridiculously heavy. This is what it looks like. So it's quite big. It has a wood base. And then you do have like a little dimmer switch that you can make it brighter or you can make it like more romantic. Um, great for a teenager for their room to kind of give like a fun glow. We actually have one in the kids rooms. They love it. Um, I just think it's a great, it's a great gift for everyone. And you can Google like the benefits of having a Himalayan salt lamp. It's supposed to put like some, some kind of ions into the air to make your air. Let me just Google it. Okay. This one was... $12.96, super affordable. Let's just Google the, the benefits. Here we go, are you guys ready? 12 reasons to keep a Himalayan salt lamp in every room of the house, every room. It balance the, balances the electromagnetic radiation, cleanse, deodorize, and purifies air, calms allergies and reduces asthma, alleviates coughing and other symptoms of the common cold, boosts blood flow, raises energy levels, sharpens concentration and performance, enhances mood. My gosh, who knew they were so good? I know I, 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 had, a, I had a feeling, I've heard it before that they're great for you, but I didn't realize it was so many. Let me see, there's more, hold on, wait, there's more. Reduces stress and promotes relaxation. So that's another great one for the office. Improves sleep. Put it next to your bed. Have it as a nightstand um, thingamabobber. And it also looks pretty and it really, it creates, let me just plug it in so you guys can see. It creates such a lovely glow that it just kind of like has this like nice vibe in the house. Like um, when you have it on your nightstand, it's just like really, it's just like cozy and lovely. Okay, you guys ready for this? It's hard to see because it's super super bright in here, but it just like creates this like warm kind of like ambery peachy orangey glow, and then you can dim it, make it bright. You can make it barely there, so it's really nice, and um, I think ev everybody would love this. So next is something that is for someone who is like very festive, loves the holiday, is like super duper into the holidays and Christmas spirit. These are super cute, you guys. Let me just take it out of the bag because the bag is not doing it justice because there's pom-poms on these babies. Um, these were super affordable. They had a bunch of different ones. I just picked the ones that I liked the most. So, you know, whatever floats your boat. These are, do 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 uh, The yoga mat was $20, 1947. Um, okay, so the fa -la, -la, la la pillow is a 14 by 20. It says it's an outdoor pillow. I'm sorry, but like I'm not sitting outside when it's freezing, but some people don't have cold winters and I, I learned that from North Carolina. You can sit outside in the winter time. So this would be great to have on your porch or on your back patio, but you can have it indoors as well. Just because it says outdoors doesn't mean you have to follow the rules. This is $14.97. It has these cute little baubles, like little pom-poms on the sides and the corners. And then in all different colors, it says fa la 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 la. So the pink is like a, or I'm sorry, the A is a light pink. This is like a fuzzy like towel material and it's just super cute. So for under $15, a cute little festive pillow. This might be fun to give to the teachers if you're not sure what they like because everybody likes Christmas, right? I mean, I think they do. Okay, and then this is another outdoor pillow. This is the Better Homes and Gardens Outdoor Toss Pillow. So again, you can have it outside on your front porch. If you have a cute little chair out there, make it look festive. Um, you could have it on your back patio or you can just stick it inside Whatever you want to do this one as well was $14.97 and this one says Merry Christmas Which I think is also a really great gift idea because it's like it's stating right what you're trying to do is give them a Merry Christmas So that's what it looks like. It's got cute little birds and candy canes and little pom-pom bobbles and then it just says Merry Christmas with a cute little wreath around. So I thought that was really cute and I love the little pink and yellow birds. This is also really cute for like a kid's bedroom to put on their bed so that their bed feels a little festive for the holidays. Like our kids love when I decorate for Christmas. I mean, they like when I decorate for all the holidays, but they love it. They love the Christmas decor. So I thought that would be cute. 
um, to have like on one of the kids' beds or you know, whatever. There's a, so many places you can put a pillow. Okay, now we're, go we're going on to the crafter. It's either a kid or it's someone who just loves to craft and like make things and um, you know, do little, what's it called? Scrapbooking and journaling and bullet journals and all that good stuff. Um, so these are some Sharpies and it's like all of the colors. I think you get silver, gold, blue, green, orange, pink, red, purple, green, blue, blue, black. All the good colors. Um, and these are the, okay, oh yes, they have the original metallics and neons. So these ones were $9.44, under 10 bucks. Super great gift. So It's so fun for kids who are doing like poster board um, projects. Once you get a little bit older, I feel like you always have to have Sharpies. Um, and they're just really fun to like make your, Lily likes to draw her own pictures and then color them in. And she's always asking for different colored Sharpies and I never have them. So I'm gonna have to make sure she has like a little something down so it doesn't transfer onto the table because they've already transferred some stamps onto the table. Like that's my new table, don't ruin it. But everything gets ruined when you have kids and pets. This also I got for Lily. I thought this would be such a fun little gift. So this one was $19.93. So again, under $20. And it is the Timeless Creations, the Art of Coloring. So it comes with a bunch of markers and coloring pencils. And it's like super fun. Um, it's got two 64 page coloring books, 10 classic fine line markers and 24 premium colored pencils. And she loves these kind where it's like the really bold black print and then you can color in all the pieces or you know, whatever. Um, and it looks like that on the inside. So just a super cute little art case. And then it's nice cause all of their stuff stays in one spot. She can slide it under the bed or under her um, desk or whatever and then she can color whenever she wants to so I thought that was a really great gift especially like once the winter time comes for us it is very snowy and cold here so the kids do love to play outside but there are days when it's like super stormy and like really really freezing that you know you want to play inside and have some activities that are not just like an iPad or TV so I wanted to get a nice little coloring kit for her not that she doesn't have colors already she has tons but I think it's just fun when it's like in a little kit like this in a little briefcase it's like you feel very special those are all of my gift ideas under $25 that are unique affordable and fun for lots of different type of people I will be having like specific uh, gift guide for her gift guide for kids and gift guide for him on my channel and I'll be having like a gift guide for like beauty lovers that are you know shows all like the beauty stuff that I think is fun for the holidays but I really wanted this one to be a super affordable um, gift guide and I want it to be just kind of like unique things that you wouldn't expect that are just kind of like I'm not everybody likes makeup you know so I wanted it to be kind of like a good variety of all sorts of stuff and then the last item that I or I'm sorry I have two one of them is a trampoline it's outside we have it I got it from Walmart I'll link the exact one we got it is amazing the kids jump on it all the time they absolutely love it and I feel like it's awesome because it gives them a little bit of exercise without them realizing they're exercising, you know? So it's really good. I like to jump on it, but it makes me feel like I have to pee my pants, which is so unfortunate, but that's what happens when you have kids. Um, but it is amazing exercise. Like I do a few jumps, feel like I have to pee my pants and then I'm like, wow, I'm pooped out, you know? So it's good exercise. So I would highly recommend a trampoline. They have a ton right now. I'll link a bunch of different ones, but I'll link specifically the exact one that we have. Ours has like the zip up enclosure and the kids love it. And then this, I actually have one for myself and then I actually purchased one on the sale for my brother and for Lindsay for their house. Um, so this is the Ionvac Smart Clean RoboVac 2000. So I spoke about this on Instagram stories. So many of you guys bought them because it was on sale from, I think it was like 179 or 189 down to $99. And you guys, this is such a great little gift because, well, when I got it, it was $99. So that was a super awesome, under a hundred bucks, amazing. Um, it's a great gift to give as a couple if they've just, you know, bought their first house or moved and like everyone needs a vacuum. And this is amazing because you just press it and it just goes and vacuums your house for you. So you don't have to vacuum. You don't have to do anything. You literally just let him go. We called ours Mr. Thing. The kids love him. I love him. He saves so much time out of my day because I don't have to vacuum and he just goes around he goes on carpet he goes on floor um, so it's such a great gift if you are like kind of 
struggling with like what to get a couple or a family and you're just like oh, I just don't know you always hear about like oh don't get her a vacuum for Christmas but you know sometimes you just do want a good vacuum and vacuums are kind of pricey and I found out that, that one was gonna be on sale for 99 bucks I was like oh I'm getting one for my brother and Lindsay because they've talked about getting a Robovac I don't think they have one yet hopefully they don't um, and I just feel like they're super convenient and we absolutely love ours I've been having it well what about it? it's been like two two or three weeks I don't know how long it's been but I've put that thing to the test and we have so much stuff to suck up. The dogs are constantly going outside, bringing in a bunch of leaves and bits of bark and chewing up things. I mean, they're just a disaster. Um, and then just with kids and crumbs and just, you know, living, there's just, there's a mess all the time. So that thing is amazing. It just runs. Usually I run it like twice a day and I just let it pick up all the stuff and it is so, so good. So highly recommend that. I'll link that down below for you guys. Again, that one's a little bit more on the pricey side, I mean, compared to 25 bucks, but so worth it and such a great gift if you want to get like a good, like a big gift for a couple or just a whole family, that is definitely the one to go with. So there is my unique gifts under $25 from Walmart. I hope that you guys enjoyed and found that helpful and got some good ideas. Again, everything will be linked down below. Huge thank you to Walmart for partnering up with me yet again for another video. I love doing gift guides. They're so much fun. I've been doing all of my like holiday shows. I'm like so organized this year. Not in life. Oops, not in life at all. As you can hear, I have dishes in my sink. But um, for my gifts, I've been, I started early this year and I feel like I'm getting it, like I'm getting my act together because every year I'm like, I'm gonna be more organized and then it comes and I'm like, mm, I'm not organized, I suck. So this year I've already gotten quite a few Christmas gifts and I'm starting my gift guide early so that you guys can take advantage of all the sales and definitely follow me on Instagram because when there are sales or when there are like, is there, if there's just a specific item on sale or if there is a whole entire site wide sale, I will post on Instagram before I will ever do it on YouTube because usually I'm gonna order the stuff and then by the time I get it, the sale is already done. So I always post on Instagram stories if I am like, hey, sale alert or hey, deal alert, like that vacuum, I told you guys about it on there. And it's just like, a, it's just easier for me because I don't have to edit and upload and make a huge video. And it takes a lot of time to film and then edit and upload and link. It just is like a full day process for one video. So sometimes I just don't have the time, especially with the kids at home learning. So it's just so much easier for me to just quickly like, jump on stories hey here you go here's what's going on and i share a lot more content on instagram stories than i do on youtube um just just because it's easier so definitely be follow definitely be sure to follow me on instagram i do have two um one is at sam sherman and that is just my just regular Instagram I've always had and then I have a new one that is called our home in Tahoe and that one is more like home decor and just like all of my oil my favorite oil blends and recipes and roller balls and what I'm diffusing that day so that's just kind of like dedicated just to that so that if you're like girl I don't care about your oils then follow me on at Sam Sherman if you're like yes I do like oils I'm all about the oily life and home decor then go on to that one. You guys can go and follow me over there. And then I just feel like it's kind of a little bit more personable. Not that YouTube isn't personable, but I feel like I can like interact with you guys like right then, you know, like I post a story, you guys write me back, I write you right back. And I'm very good about replying to my stories. And you know, like if you guys have questions, I answer them on there. I have people constantly DMing me. So I'm very active on Instagram. I would say that's my most active platform and it's honestly the platform that I like the most because I really feel like I get to like know you guys as like as people I see your guys's comments on these videos whereas on Instagram I can like look at your pictures and I can like get a feel for you guys and I get to know you more so it's just an easier way for me to to like communicate with you guys and like I just feel like it's funner it's a little bit more I don't know, it's like a cozier space. Definitely be sure to follow me on Instagram. That would be amazing. And if you guys haven't followed me or subscribed to me, I should say here on YouTube, then please do. I'll be having a lot more holiday content coming out, some gift guides. I'm gonna be doing a fall perfume or fall scents to try for him and her. So that's coming very soon. Um, so yeah, I just have a lot of a festive content coming. So be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Bye. Ow, freaking label.